this guy. How are your travels going, Prince? Still can't catch any fish, but I did reel in a bottle of this odd message in it. The dart while under the waves, dolphin kick badge. Huh, what do you suppose that's all about? Oh, we got dolphin kick too! If you're seeking a particular course, press L. From there, select a course by pressing A and you'll jump straight to the destination. Oh, that's cool. We got swig Ooh, a Wiggler swimming race. Yeah. Alright, let's do Dolphin Kick 2. So I just got back? I just got back too. You're fine. I've been here for like a second. Very correct to a drawn eye Twitch used to appear in streams and stuff, but you were tired or something. Possible save for sure. Yeah, exactly. You just tired or something. Um, I think I think uh I think uh She's probably just very busy being the inventor of Twitch all. Now, I feel like I'm kind of racing these other people. Oh my god, I'm gonna die! Okay, we're fine. I'm tall again. I am besting this challenge. <laughs> no, I died! Oh, wait, whoa, I got revived by one of these guys. That's crazy. What releases on the 17th? Uh, Scott Pokemon takes off. Yep. It's gonna be pretty sweet. Yeah, okay, I can do that. Wait. Help me! That's so cool. This is an interesting mode. This is Dark Souls thing. Oh, Super Mario RPG? Wait, isn't Super Mario RPG coming out tomorrow? Or something? I, I didn't know it was on the 17th. I thought it was sooner. No, on the 17th? Really? The same day as Scott Pilgrim takes off? Oh, whoops. Where RPG release date? 2023? A remake? Is it? November 17th? Oh, that's so cool. Wow, I didn't know that both were coming. Well, now that's going to be hard to tell when people are saying they're excited for November 17th. They're talking about Scott Pilgrim or Super Mario RPG. Oh. Oh, no! Wait, I think we're all ghosts. <laughs> Hi, Kayla B. This is so interesting. Playing with other players online. Good ball. Looks like there's various things to find, though. Oh, I'm not tall enough. Fuck! Thank you, Toad. Wait, no! <laughs> no, I almost made it to the standee. Oh my god. He's not six feet tall. I know he's so little and adorable. They're so nice to each other. Oh, there's another. Oh, okay. There's different areas. So which one is like the right one? Oh, okay. There's two pipes out, but doesn't feel very impressive. Get that coin. Uh, I'll probably just try again. Oh, wait. So, wait, 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 wait. Oh, 
Okay. Um. Sure, you can wear it. Um, what was I gonna say? Oh, okay, so we were talking about the 17th, you were excited for the Mario RPG then. I put the switch sound there. It's, it's, yeah, the switch snap sound is honestly pretty good. I do like it. Alright, okay, I got this. Daisy and yellow yo- oh, there's fucking yellow Yoshi. Boo! <laughs> Yellow Yoshi can't even die. I did not give a flap. So nice. This like brute sound he's making is, is funny. Uh oh. Shit! No! <laughs> Fuck, now I'm short and I can't do it. Big Teal, he's only yellow because he's full of piss. I don't know what she sees in him, Green Yoshi. <laughs> full of piss. The piss, Yoshi. Show me what you can do! Show me what you can do! Oh. There we go. You're welcome, folks. Someone else give me a standee or... Okay. Thanks, Rebecca. I think there's still another flag after this, so... These sound effects kind of remind me of uh, how they were in Super Mario Sunshine. Okay. Oh. I didn't technically get this one before, I guess. Scary! Oh, wait. Right. Ghost is a little scary. She died? Oh. Shit, now I'm still not tall enough for that. Wait, there's a block over here. Take a minute here if you want. Okay. Take a minute here if you want. Take a minute. Oh, oh my god! Okay, we're fine. Woohoo! to get the blocks down here over here and to get the blue dark <laughs> it's killing me not to tell you about that last time it's okay I got it why do I want all the coins so bad I don't know there's something fun about doing that in the old Mario games you know well old this is literally brand new but in the Mario games, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, you gotta love these sound effects. This and then I'll so that I have at least one. Okay, I thought they would fucking give us a fire flower or some shit there at least, but alright. Oh my god. Oh! Yeah, we dodged it! We got him! Wait. 
I haven't still technically got the middle coin. I did not realize that was gonna happen to me. I got squished. Okay. Um, can I even get that still? Oh yeah, I can. Okay, we're chilling. It's fine. Once they've gone for the 100%, I think I am left one or two levels. Uh, I did not like. And I missed the middle point. Oh shit! Well, that's cool. That's worth going. Oh! Back four. Oh! Okay, we're good. I just left Toad to hang. Oh. Oh. Well, I already got it once, so we're fine. Dolphin kick too! Oh, yeah. Alright, now let's race that fucking Wiggler dude. <laughs> Thank you, Paul. Okay, hold Y and move to dash. Reach the goal before Wiggler. Wait, I thought that was a mushroom! What is wrong with me? Whatever, who needs that mini coin? It's a risk I don't want to take at this point. I'm doing the creep face. No. This is cute. They're so encouraging to me. I'm too short for that. <laughs> that was terrifying. Go, Ouija! Cute. Um, was there coins in here? I don't think I got a single one. How's that supposed to land? Yeah, Ouija'd. <laughs> right. You just got Ouija'd. We did it. We beat Wiggler and we got a Wonder Sea too. Can't believe a fast Wiggler is even in the water. Wiggler didn't mess around. Uh huh. Oh, no, there wasn't. Noted. Wait, look at this. <laughs> what? Why didn't he want to be buddies? I thought that'd be fun. I thought we could both run around this. It'd be like a bonding thing or something. I guess, I guess. I guess he was mad that it was copying him, I don't know. That's so sad. <laughs> I just wanted- I just wanted to be pals. Okay. Um... Hmm. What's I say? You know that you can customize controls for dashing and ground pounding. What? Oh. All right, let's go with downpour uproar, except for, oh wait, it'll tell me when I enter the level that I can change my band, probably? Okay, um, let's go with floating high jump. Oh, wait, maybe the, the, the dolphin swim would have been smart because then you can dash through the, the, the thing. Kind of cool. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna leave on this like ghost feature. It's kind of cute, but I don't think, like, I'm 
I don't feel like I need it right now, you know? Like, it's cute that it kind of makes it easier. The little, you know, being able to see people is kind of cute. But, um... At the same time... Yeah, you're kind of seeing people, like, play ahead of you. Actually, I'm gonna exit the course. And turn off the online. This way... No one, no one, none of them are ahead of me and show me how to do things before I want to see how they're done. Yeah, let's see. Oh, here we go. There we go. Yeah, it's cute. I like that you can also play with friends online. That's really good. But, uh, I feel like the ghost feature I would like a lot more if I was playing, like, off-stream, like, alone, maybe? Too much hassle to go into settings. Just unplug your router, yeah. That's the- that's the hassle-free way. <laughs> the stream just ends. It's gotta be something over here. Yeah. Yep. Why? Yeah, this feels peaceful. Now, I, now it, it, it's I feel more immersed. Like I am Luigi, you know, experiencing. Oh shit! Now, I don't feel like I have to compare myself to Becca thirty-eight. I don't. Did he say seeing me taste like the ocean? Does when he look at me make it, his mouth salty? I just love the beach so much. Oh, it worked. Yippee! Wait. Hmm. Oh. Wait, I don't have my dolphin badge on! Son of a bitch! I can't get that coin because I don't have the right fucking badge on. What? That's so depressing. Oh shit. Hold on, I'm just gonna go down here and get this. Yay! Oh shit. Yeah, the dolphin kick bad. I don't know. If I die, then I'll flip it. I'm impressed! Yeah. Disrespected again. So nice! Every once in a while, I forget that he says that, and then it's, and then it's, and then, and then I'm, and then I'm filled with joy. When, when Luigi, Luigi turned into Borat that one time, remember? I am the rain. <gasps> See, those are rain clouds, like they're gloomier looking, so. I guess, I wonder what, like, why it's, I guess an elephant. Some, oh, fuck. There's some good reason for this. Instant serotonin. Exact. Oh! Wait, what's up here, though? Should I look? What's the real secret? Probably this pipe. Hmm. Okay. Nope, I hate coins. Ah. <laughs> uh, oh. yeah. <laughs> yeah, got him. Oh, that's cute. Um, 
We can't water those flowers though because I'm not an elephant anymore. I wonder if there's anything down there. I guess I already got the two coins though, so what could it be? I guess the seed? It's worth looking, I guess. Oh, there's nothing. All right. Great. I, I, the way that it's gray is making me feel sad. I like being poor. I like being poor. That's why I haven't pulled myself up by my bootstraps, like they say. Storm Jabroid. Yeah. Oh, shit. Okay. Got this. Oh my god, it's cute! Oh my god! The 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 the, 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 the light! Ow! Okay, so the flashing is warning. Oh shit! Go, oh, Luigi! Shock! Fuck off! Okay, there we go. Oh. Wait. Oh, okay. I thought maybe I could hit the clouds. Okay, that was scary. I was worried that the star would wear out while I was getting shocked by lightning. Oh, okay. No more star. Oh! Wait! Woo! Okay, we're chilling. Everything's good. Huh. Really like this one? Yeah, that was really cool. I like these seed little activities that you do. They're really nice. Oh, for a second I thought he said try again. I was like, bitch. Wowie, zowie. Okay, that's kind of fucked up. There we go. Cool. Yeah, these are really fun and well-designed levels. I like them. Seems like a classic Mario platform with some fun add-ins. Yeah, I mean, it feels... It, it definitely feels different from, like, Super Mario World or Super Mario Bros. 3 because... I mean, it just feels different. I don't even know how to fully describe what's different about it. But it feels to me like the new Super Mario Bros. games, which I always really liked. So like it still it still has Mario Bros. That that basic feel, but it's missing probably like the you know the parts that make you want to fucking I don't know get hemorrhoids from rage, which is part of fun when you play old Mario. Um, but oh my god, Finn, how's it going? How are you? I guess I just asked that question twice. Yeah, shout out to Finom Fin Finom Finom. Phenomenon. <laughs> a great, a great, a good. Uh, 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 sorry, I'm just at loss for words. This is so exciting. Um, a great retro streamer, and yeah, yeah go check him out. All right, but yeah, no, this game you haven't played it yet. I'm just playing it now, and I'm enjoying it a lot. I think it's, a, I think it's a fun game. Shining Falls. Hmm. Not yet. Everyone I know who has it loves it. It's really good. Like, it's a fun game. Oh, I see we have some visitors. I must go greet them. Poof! Shit, that guy can teleport? We reached Shining Falls! I think I remember hearing that there's a royal seat at the top of these waterfalls. If you turn around, you can check your map with L. It was dope to finally- yeah, it was too bad that we didn't have much time to- to talk, but it was cool that we met. That was- that was awesome. Hope you had a good Vegas trip. Did you get sick? I did. Oh, it's you, Prince. Alright then, I welcome you to Shining Falls, where-
where our waterfalls offer a cascade of trials. Are you ready to take on a variety of tests that will challenge you to the fullest? Set your sights at the very top of the waterfalls. There you'll find the royal seed. Oh wait, can I just skip the trials and get the royal seed please? He is the prince. <laughs> ah, sorry, rules are rules, even for a prince. What? A non-corrupt government? No, this game is so unrealistic. Give me something to help you along the way. All right, what do you got? Oh, you got us a wonder seed. Someone avoided getting sick. I think the boosters and emergency all week might have helped. Hell yeah. Yeah, I unfortunately got sick. I was just telling Rachel, I, I think I need to go to the doctor more because I'm still coughing. Oh no, pneumonia! I hope it's not pneumonia. Looks like we're going to have to pass all these trials to reach the top. You should have picked up the best badge for the job. If you ever think we need to change badges, just call me with R. How does he know what R is? Alright, let's go. Standees until we get Luigi. No, I hate when we get duplicates. No! We can't. We didn't bring out Luigi. This is so sad. Okay. Search party, empty park, question mark? Okay. Let's do it. Renegade? She's doing charity streams for Food Banks Canada. Oh, that's so cool, Renegade! Hell yeah! Food Banks of Canada, let's go! Find all the wonder tokens hidden in the plaza. If you can't find them on your own, look with a friend. I'm totally gonna find them all. Oh, this is kind of cool. At least this one, having an invisible platform you smack with your head is like the whole gimmick versus the other one where it was it just did that to you. And it felt felt kind of personal. Hi capped. Oh shit. My fucking god! That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, I tried to. Br I brought tea that I drink that's supposed to help with the uh, immune system to Vegas, but they don't have fucking kettles there because nobody, I guess, drinks tea in Vegas. They only drink booze or something. I don't know. Watching Alberta local news. I think I mentioned in anyway. They ran a story about the food bank stuff. So I was surprised. I don't think I know what the news is around food bank stuff. Unless you mean they ran a segment about what food banks are. In which case, I do know what food banks are. But if there's news about food banks, I don't actually know. Super high usage. Oh, that's not fucking surprising. Groceries are expensive here. They're asking for help. Yeah, yeah. People probably actually need food banks like a lot right now. So. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Somebody needs to crack down on those fucking groceries. And someone's gonna be me if I crack down. You know? I mean, smack somebody. So we have a carrying case that allows you to take a Ramona Flowers amount of TV everywhere you go. <laughs> Thank you. Um, yes, this is true about me. Correct assumption. Um, I actually don't normally take much tea with me. Um, I thought that they would take it away from me, and then I realized that they actually don't take away things like packaged tea. So, I brought it, and then I didn't even get to use it! The restaurant that I had pho at, though, some vegan pho, um, had, uh, chamomile tea, though, which was nice. Because I also ordered an iced tea, and I always- <sighs> 
I don't always forget, but I kind of, when I ordered it, kind of forgot that iced tea is different in America than it is in Canada. And it was disgusting. And the guy also, he like, he like hyped it up to me really hard too. So I was like, okay. He was like, oh yeah, it's brewed fresh, it's delicious. And it wasn't, it was bad. That was caffeinated tea, that was black tea that probably sat in a fucking pot for like a hundred years. And was bitter as shit with no nothing in it. Who drinks that? Gross. Me. <laughs> Gross. I don't like it. And I judge your bitter palate. I like dark chocolate. How's it different? If you order an iced tea in Canada at a restaurant, they give you um Fuck, do you have brisk? They give you like a nest tea iced tea. Or uh, I don't know. It's different. But like you can also order like an iced tea, which is like like a, a tea iced. And but usually they put shit in it. They don't just fucking brew that shit for six hours, fucking six bags and a pot of tea they just let it sit all the tannins and shit release it's just like drinking fucking i don't know copper or something and they don't even they don't even put they don't even try to put anything in it so these people have culture shock when they buy ice cream tea in america if it uh it has sugar in it which, wait, is it common in, in Japan to have iced green tea, though? Like, are you talking, like, an Arizona tea? Because that would make sense. There's a fuck. there's so much sugar in those Arizona teas. Can I just get something that's half lemonade, half iced tea? Oh. As a diabetic, I prefer my bitter tea. I got used to drinking without a sugar. I'm not even just talking about the sh the sugar. I'm talking about tea being brewed that way. Because, um... Black tea can taste really fucking good without without any sugar. If it's not brewed in the, in the worst way possible. And made a fucking... The tea bag is made out of fucking dirt. Dust. So that's just me being a, a, a big tea. Tea head. So, like... I'm not even someone who typically adds a lot of stuff to my tea. But, like, a black tea that's been made really, really bitter. Just serve straight. It's so- it's so gross! I shouldn't have- I shouldn't have believed him when he said it was great. You said it, forget it, boil and go. Oh! No. No. What? Ha! Ah. Listen. Listen. I, I'm not I'm not trying to be the person that doesn't let people enjoy things. So if you wanna if you wanna drink your tea that way, fine. Fine. But um Oh my god, is it ever fucking gross? Like, when people are like, oh I don't like tea. When I was younger, I like I really didn't get it. I was like, there's so many different kinds of tea and stuff. Now that I know that sometimes the only fucking tea that anyone's ever had is that fucking gross ass shit where it's been sitting in a pot for an hour and it's just all the tannins are out of it and the leaves in the first place have been fucking destroyed. It's gross. It's not even tea. You're just drinking like... I don't even know what that is. I don't even know what, what that is, but I... Ugh. But basically... The, if, uh, the reason I say this is, um, the, the quality difference between loose leaf and bagged tea, typical bagged tea that isn't, like, leaves, is actually quite, it's quite different. Even that, that said, you can still enjoy, you can still enjoy a bagged tea. Um, it's just, there is quite a big quality difference. For example, I could show it to you. I actually, I don't fucking have any loose leaf right now. Because I've been drinking herbal teas and not caffeinated teas. But... Um, leaves, like, a, a good loose leaf, you'll be able to see that it's leaves. If you open a, a typical bag, like a Tetley bag or whatever, if you open it, it's just, like, dust. So a lot of the time, they collect all the tea leaves, and then what goes in those, like, Tetley bags or whatever brand you might drink, um, 
is just the dust, all the sweepings that come off of it. So it's all the stems and shit. And then, um, normally with teas, like in, in like China, like the culture around tea is quite different. And what basically what happened, the reason why tea is even drank with the bag and all that shit is because of a, um, a, an error when they sent tea over to Britain, they sent it in silk, um, a, a little silk bags. And when they got that shit, they were like, ah, and they just plunked it in the water. And that's how they decided they were going to drink tea for the rest of fucking eternity, I guess. So, um, <laughs> normally you would pull, you pull the bag out after a certain amount of time because you don't want the tannins to release into the tea. The tannins are what gives it that, like, very bitter taste. And the longer it's in there, the more bitter and the more tannins release. So that's that's what that is. So tea, when it when you're having a, a black tea loose leaf, and you pull it out, it is it is like a totally different experience than drinking just the fucking rose red shit that's been sitting in a pot with fucking nothing in it. Like, because you can enjoy tea can be so good without anything in it. Like. When I make tea, I don't add anything to it because I don't need to add cream or sugar to a tea that's brewed properly because it's not bitter. But. Imagine telling people back in China, Liz Sao just took the silk bags and dunked them in the water. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. So, like, if you enjoy tea like that, you know, like I said, that's actually, that's, that, you know, that's up to you. I'm not trying to be that guy. But when I hear it, I'm, it actually, and I'm like, ah, oh, how? <laughs> like it, it makes it makes me physically like my body tenses up when I think about it. So I started drinking green tea instead of coffee, and then they should not do that on empty stuff. So yeah, did you throw up? <laughs> did you throw up? I have a friend who says her favorite way to drink tea is pour a glass of cold water, drop a bag of Earl Grey into it, start drinking it immediately. What? What is that? Is that like the LaCroix of tea? Like the tea won't even release the... What the fuck kind of shit is that? I got a hint of the fucking tea flavor. A hint of a hint of tea. Sounds great. I would... I would love... I would love to brew everyone some proper tea. That doesn't taste like ass. Because, like, it is a legitimate way. It is a legitimate way to drink it if you fucking want to. You know, I know that tea, especially in Britain, is, is, has been a big cultural thing, even though for forever, forever they've been doing it <laughs> incorrectly to the point where it's like, okay, it's, it's, it's the way it's the way it's, it's, it's had. It's fine. But it's 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 just so different than it can be. TwitchCon team meetup next year. Next time I'll make a, next time, next, next time. I made the same joke, hell yeah. Next time I'll bring some loose leaf and then also a mini kettle probably because they don't fucking, they don't fucking like it to give you kettles and this goddamn. Anyway, I don't know. I, I don't think, uh, I think the CEO of Twitch said that, 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 that it wouldn't be in uh, Vegas. Can you just, oh. The, the, uh. So maybe, I don't know, maybe if it's in San Diego again. Because there were kettles in San Diego. This is San Diego, I, I will drink it, I guess. Oh. What's going on? What's going on? On, on. I guess you need to do a tea stream? I would love to. I've done a few actually before, but you know what? Maybe it's time to bring it up again. And that also, because I, yeah, since I can't have caffeine, um, I've been drinking just whatever herbal tea. Also, because Davis Tea, I was on a tea subscription with Davis Tea, and then they just kept on not sending me tea, and then eventually they just canceled the subscription. And we're like, yeah, sorry, we don't have enough tea. And I was like, what kind of fucking tea store doesn't have tea? Oh. Okay. But yeah, um, you can actually buy David's tea and all this stuff to make loose leaf tea on Amazon. 
Um, I think for a while I had like a little list where you could buy all the shit that you needed to try it. I'm not exactly sure why I decided to go back down. I just wanted to see if I could. Now I'm here. I frequently make loose leaf jasmine tea. Usually my go-to, especially when I don't want some- Oh, jasmine is so good. I love jasmine tea. Dude, if you blend jasmine and oolong together, that shit's so good. be a cold day before I ever get a switch. No, Manny! Kind of weird in Canada we descended from British. We drink way more coffee. Yeah, we do drink way more coffee. I think it's because we're next to America. You know, we t we like to take a lot of American customs, but I do notice that Canada does have a lot of more of a, a culture around tea than America. Based off of, just based off of my personal experience and like talking to people, because like growing up, it was like really normal to be like, oh, do you want to go for tea? Even if you were just going to go to Tim Hortons or something. Um, or go to someone's house and they would offer you tea. I noticed that, like, typically when I'm, like, with Americans, it's, like, it's like harder to get tea. It's, like, a, it's like more of a niche thing. Like, like, for example, not having a fucking kettle in my hotel room. What the fuck? <laughs> Who is Jasmine? <laughs> Ooh, rose tea mixed with oolong. I never tried that. That would be great. Also, before I have to go to customs, try to save Pappy from the dude, then we'll believe she's bringing in tea to the US. Yeah, I would have to probably get like the bagged loose leaf from David's tea, which is still not proper or any of the whatever, but it's still a good quality at least. But that way it'd be packaged so they wouldn't question me on it. If it's just loose loose, they're gonna take it away. I used to be such a coffee nerd and so precise. I don't know uh, how I have it, but now I can't drink caffeine. Aww. And like decaf coffee still has a little bit of caffeine. And like, I don't know if you can have like, if like if you're such a nerd about, about, about coffee, it's like, can you even have it? How? decaf how you would have right but like um eh. I jump. okay cool um she told me uh or if you did not realize it but they would have brought you one up to the room and they would do that with how many points well that's a, i said that to um to harley but they said that um, they didn't think that they would have multiple kettles because they were they worked in a hotel. But I was thinking that too, kind of. I was like, ah. yeah, decaf makes me very sad. That's fair. Yeah, I mean like loose leaf tea is or not loose leaf, but herbal tea is still really good. It's not quite the same as having like caffeinated tea because I mean it's it's a different plant, right? Because tea. Tea, black tea, green tea, oolong, all that. All those kinds of tea, all the caffeinated teas come from the same plant. Um, except for maybe yerba mate? Possibly? Um, but like rooibos is a different thing. And like all of your herbal teas are just like leaves and shit. But um, so it's a, it's a bit different. You know, with the herbal teas, you don't really have to worry that much about brew time or anything like that. I'm sure there's a bit of a difference. Like, if I if I looked it up, I'm sure I would find that, like, oh, yeah, peach tea or something probably tastes quite different if it sits in there for too long or something. That's, like, don't quote me on that. I'm just making that up. But um, it's not quite the same because there's no tannins to release. 
I see him. Yeah. That makes sense. I should have asked for a fucking Keto. Oh well. Yeah, well, and like the the er, the the um herbal teas also don't hit the same way as like a green tea does or something. It's so sad. Every once in a while, I let myself have a little bit of a caffeinated tea, and it's really nice. But thank you. One thing that's always been true about Mario: you gotta time your jump really well. That's true, Cody. That's true. Welcome in. Nicely done, we got the badge, you use it as a gift. Do you want me to wear it? Yeah, fuck it. Very cynical about Vegas where you think every decision involves squeeze. Well, most of them, yeah. Took me a long time to master that secret technique. Years. You just learned it so quickly. Well, you're not finding the next challenge so easy, I believe. Oof. Why can that guy teleport? What's your deal? What's this one? The Anglefish Trial. Ready, aim, fly. Anglefish. That seems like fun. What's this one? The Midway Trial. Hop, hop to it. Freeze or freeze. Oh. Oh. I can drink a cup of coffee like an hour before bed and I still sleep fine. That is common in those who are... Uh, who have ADHD. Not diagnosing you with ADHD. If being able to do so does not mean you have ADHD. I'm not a doctor. However. However. Fun fact. I have the same superpower. The only problem is if I did it. If I got, if I got it for a couple hours. Drank a cup of coffee. Went back to sleep for a few hours. I would get sleep paralysis. Growing up in a Japanese American household means it's green tea or nothing for me. Really, you don't like other kinds of tea? I mean, green tea are really good though. Here we go. I mean, green green tea is really good though. I do like a green tea. Oh. Yeah. I just had a pot of coffee and zonk out within an hour. I'm tired. I was a mad diagnosed ADHD. Hell yeah. Oh. Ah. I really enjoy other teas, like green, I guess. All right, that's fair. I'll say one of the nicest hotels in Vegas. Aria, it's a really nice room. They charged me a dollar to add Rachel to the room because I did not add her when I booked the room. A dollar? Those fuckers. It's like, okay, yeah, I guess I'll pay a dollar, but what? <laughs> a dollar? Like, it's not super expensive, but it's almost petty because it's not super expensive. Oh, shit, I fucked that up. <laughs> I bet you it won't respawn. They haven't been giving me second chances like that these days. <laughs> Why is the water piss on this level? I've been drinking more tea recently since so cutting down on sodas and stopped drinking. Hell yeah. Sweet tea be so good to be fair. Yeah, sweet tea is what is what um is what the that's what the ice the, what's the ice the ice tea is. I like that. Cause usually I don't I don't fucking know what's going on over in other places, but here, um usually they give you like if you're if you get if you get if you can order pop with your meal, iced tea is usually one of the options with a sweet tea. So you can get yourself a fuck! You get yourself a nice, a nice ice, a nice, a nice iced or slash sweet tea, um, instead of uh, you know a fucking cola or whatever. Wow, Mario's big ass snails now. Only know Mario to have turtles you could jump on and KO with their own shell. Um, yeah. I mean, it's not uncommon for uh, Mario games to add new enemies and stuff. Um, so, yeah, this is a different, it's a different kingdom that's just a short hop away from the Mushroom Kingdom, according to the, the, the intro. Oh, what the fuck? It wasn't even really worth it. I restarted level twice for one fucking measly little purple-ass coin. What? Whatever, I'm getting it. Ow! 
You little shit. You ruined it. Like Lipton iced tea? I don't know if you have that there. Oh, uh, you the mm, I think the Lipton one's a bit different. Do you guys not have brisk or nest tea? I think the, the Lipton one is a little bit more of like a real tea type feeling tea. Like the other ones. Oh, the the brisk and nest tea ones are similar to the Arizona ones, but they're probably actually have less sugar still by a, a margin. Yeah, that's so weird. The tea culture is so different. Wowie, like tea bags, we get a lot of brisk in Arizona teas that are bottled. Yeah, that's what that's what I'm talking about. Like if you're if you're if you're gonna if you're gonna have pop from a restaurant, they might give let you have the option of having a fucking canned iced tea. Um, which is, I like to get that sometimes. It is caffeinated though. So, a lot of the, a, a lot of the times these days I just don't get anything from there. I say fuck it. But yeah, it's usually between that and ginger ale for me, if, if anything. And sometimes Dr. Pepper. I do like Dr. Pepper. Controversial. <laughs> but I, I like it. Ew. Fishy. Wait, no! Maybe come back. Oh, shit. It's like tea bags. You gotta. Oh, wait, I already read that ad up! Dr. Pepper's underrated. Yeah, some people really fucking hate Dr. Pepper. I don't really understand that. I don't. I don't see what, uh. What, how it's, it's such a different flavor. Like. To me, Dr. Pepper is kind of similar to Cherry Coke, but. I don't know. Don't let him take it. Here it is. My grandpa is really into the Walmart version. Dr. Thunder? No, not the fucking... Not... Oh, I hate those fucking bootleg soda shit. <laughs> Dude, I remember one time when I was a kid, we got... No, it wasn't the so. It wasn't the soda. It was, um... We got bootleg Fruit Loops. And they tasted like salt, it was awful. Yeah, exactly. Like it's it, it definitely isn't cherry coke. But like it yeah, it has that it has that like, you know, that like fruity flavor. Star brands are just a regular thing. Not always. Not always. With some things, yes, like a lot of the times with like canned food and shit. But like those Dr. Thunder ass ones, sometimes they are different and they have different formulas, especially with things like um, Coca-Cola because they've, they've, oh, they have different patents and shit. Certain, certain things can get away with it. Yeah. Those fucking bootleg Fruit Loops were... We're, um, we're not good. And trust me, like, I did not grow up in a brand name household. Um, they have, um, they have a brand here called, it's actually called No Name, and it's, but it's, it's a store brand for, for No Frills. But, like, literally a lot of that shit's the same. Like, we were, we were always using the No Name brands, but, like, certain things, those, those Fruit Loops were bad. Cereal and Pop, I think, were, like, the main things that were different. Um... Oh, shit. I miss that flower. 
those like brand name marketing and ads is gonna have some copyright on the port. Yeah, there's certain things like I, like cans of beans. You know, getting the Heinz versus the non Heinz, I don't think is a big difference. Um, but if you get like the 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 fucking the non Heinz ketchup, I think it's a bit different too. But like that's not different enough to really matter, I don't think. Some people are Heinz heads though. Not me though. I don't give a fuck. Okay. Whatever, I'm just gonna... Fruit Loops is spelled like that because Fruit Loops illegally have to include actual fruit. <laughs> That's amazing. I grew up on No Name Blood. Still eat a lot of them and think they're mostly fine, but definitely aren't like a real thing. Yeah, so some of them aren't the same. Some of them are the same though. No name and president choices. Yeah! Yeah, I always thought that it was weird that we have a store brand called President's Choice because, like, what? Which president? We have a pro we have a prime minister. Who's president? Who's president is choosing this? The president of the company? I guess it would be the president of the company's choice. These are sort by name brands. Um, but since becoming an adult with my own money, I really don't care. That's funny. I saw um, a post from someone that was like, now that I'm an adult, I'm realizing that mom is right. We do have food at home. I'm like, wow. <laughs> I don't know. If I was a mom, I'd feel a little bit, I'd feel a little bit angry right now, not gonna lie. Now that I'm doing it, I, I... <laughs> Oh no. Go back! Up! Oh, I did it. Martin Van Buren's choice. Hell yeah. All right. Yeah, the leading brand is a target. Yeah, they're like, this is the leading brand of fucking paper towels. But all of them say that, so what is- And what is- Like, what do you mean by leading brand, anyway? That's a vague enough sentence that it could mean it, it could mean really nothing. Like I know it's supposed to implicate that like it's the top brand, but leading brand where? Pulled how? Yeah. Uh yeah you know fuck it we'll, we're midway trial hop to it perfect. Brand leading in Idaho. Brand leading in this one really small town. What was that? I don't know where to say the company name. Oh, like the other companies now when they they when they bully each other. Yay! It's coming alive. Whatever, I don't want it anymore. Fuck. I just saw the weirdest thing. Hmm. Oh, what? Ah! Um, were you alive for when Sega and Nintendo made ads start directly targeting each other? Uh. I don't remember seeing them. So probably not. Cause um Yeah, Sega cause Sega systems weren't really a thing anymore by the time I was playing video games. Like like they, they might have been, but like it was not. I don't remember it being like a thing. 
Like, I remember PlayStation versus Xbox, but I don't even know if PlayStation and Xbox were fighting each other. I think that was just people. Oh my god, fuck. Oh my god, fuck! Alright, that was scary. Damn it! Oh, is that? Uh, yeah. Oh my god, no! That's so sad, I just got the flag. Heading on, Capt. Have a good one. Oh, what? I'm a little guy. Oh, shit. I'm a little guy who can jump. Super great. Hold on, I want to get the other little guy. Okay, now I'm upset. Well, the longer I hold it, the higher I jump. It's fine. Look at all these fireworks. It's, it, everything is so happy. How nice. It's dancing. That's so cute. Oh, I'm about to hurt it. Got my Dreamcast on launch. Aw. That's fun. Did you play Sonic Adventure 2? Battle? Because that game... I love that game. I grew up with that game. I played that game before I could read. And I cursed everything. Ooh. Ah. Ooh, and by curse everything, I mean I deleted my brother's things. Battle is game. Oh, ba Battle is the, the GameCube one? Okay, that makes sense. Damn. <laughs> Battle's a real selling point. You can't have baby fights in the Dreamcast version? Of course I played Sonic Adventure 2 Battle. It's like uh, asking if I breathe- ah, ah! Breathe oxygen. I'm glad you have strong opinions about that game. This is good. Sonic Adventure on DC. Skip Sonic Adventure 2. And God's on Sonic Adventure 2 Battle on GameCube. That's good. That's good. Then you can have the baby fights. I was, the, uh, there, there was once a recent, there was a recent one, Pepsi had an image of a Pepsi can dressed as a Coke can, the tag that said, wish you a scary Halloween, Coke responded with the same image, and the tag, everyone wants to be a hero. That's funny. You managed to overcome the trial? Maybe you do have what it takes. This trial's ahead, we'll, we'll test, it to, we'll test your metal in harder weights, in my metal. Meddling kids! Okay. Yay. Ooh, that one's four stars. Can I have baby fights in Sonic Adventure 2 on Green Dreamcast? But you can have baby fights with a Dreamcast. <laughs> you can fight babies in Sonic Adventure 2 on Green Chat. Wait, you can have baby fights in Sonic Adventure 2 on Dreamcast, but you can't. Wait, now I'm confused. What? Can you baby fight? Wait, what does the battle mean then? You see some babies. Oh! Oh, I get it. Okay, that was not worth it. I almost risked it. I almost risked it all! Okay, this is... <laughs> yeah, the game The game is actually getting harder. Um, I'm gonna put the floating jump on. You can vividly be a baby with a dream cast. You can be, you can be, you can have a dream. Please! Woo okay, yeah, I should probably have the, 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 the jump, with the jump high, jump high, jump badge on. Fuck, why? 
Why? Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. I think I just understood. I feel like a silly goosey, goosey gus now. Okay. Like, how the fuck are you supposed to get that mushroom? Oh. Chill. What? Oh! <laughs> Risk it all! Yeah. Yeah, I think that's... Ex I was thinking, I was like, what game show was that? That was the Sweet Life and Zack and Cody episode where they go to risk it all. <laughs> Glad he figured that out because I was stumped. <laughs> stumped. Just like how the mushroom has a stump. There we go. Oh, whoops. Okay. <laughs> Fuck it, I don't need it anyway. I was thinking about that exact episode of Sweet Life yesterday, really? I'm an elephant now. Oh, wait, I killed the I killed my little dude. I can't get that now. Hmm, unless this maybe this little dude will join my Nope. Alright, I guess I'm gonna miss that coin. Fuck it. Whatever. Oh, if I was an elephant, I could spit water at it maybe. And the clouds would dissolve, but I'm not an elephant. There's nobody- oh. Wowie, zowie! Wowie, zowie! Is there water around here? Oh, no. Not really. Hmm, okay. Oh, maybe it- oh. Huh. Okay. EB, so I'm gonna head out of the your stream. Remember to hydrate and beat. Thanks, Combalt. Oh! Sorry, I was afraid of that giant Goomba it scared me. Well, I'm an elephant. Ooh! I'm glad I was an elephant. Oh, I really missed that one. Right, whatever. Oh, this is so cute and pretty. Here. Oh, hold on. Get all of them. <laughs> okay, we can get all of them once I'm once I'm once it Ah Far down. We only have 71 seconds. Cool shit. I shouldn't be joking about it. I have no idea how much time it's gonna give me. Oh, we're good. <sighs> I had a dollar for every time I thought this would be a lot easier if I was the elephant. I'd have two dollars. Yeah. Yes! It died! I mean, oh no, he died. I'm so sad. Not my flower friend. Oh! Oh, well. You just ruined my fucking ending, didn't you? <gasps> Shit. Yippee! Oh, wait, no. Yeah. Waterfall screaming to the abyss. <laughs> Serves it right. Fucking. You know. Bye -bye. 
talking. So they must go have places to be and cry. <laughs> I hope you feel better, Maddie. Oh, yeah. You have a great rest of your night. Ooh. Dude, along those platforms, those you've been doing your whole life. It was a sight to behold. Oof. It was a sight to behold. Okay, timer, timer switch. Hot. Epic. Okay. <laughs> oh. 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 This is cool. I like this. This is nice. Oh shit. Oh. Go this way now. Why? Why does it have to do me like that? It's like a quarter of the time left, and it's like you're gonna run out. Look at what's happening. To the world. Uh oh. You know, if it wasn't flashing at me, I don't know, I'd probably do better. <laughs> um, by the way, if you didn't hear, uh, tonight in the Discord we're watching Zoolander together. Um, we watch- wait, I have my fucking thing charged up. I can- I could've been doing that the whole time. From here. Oh! Oh! Um, but yeah, if you wanna join us, join the Discord. We don't speak out loud, we use the, the Discord chat to talk to each other, just like Twitch chat, so. You don't have to be anxious about speaking out loud. Oh shit. Yay! But yeah, join us. It'll be a lot of fun. It'll be a great time and you're gonna love it. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I forget if I said everything I normally do about the Discord. So sorry, you were so fast. It's okay. <laughs> Just blinks and then, yeah, there's like <laughs> some weird ass thing. Yeah, it's been a minute since I've seen, seen Zoolander, so I'm really excited about it. I mean, I'm coming out. I'm not an ambi- ambi-turner. Thank you for your honesty. I don't know if that's a reference to Zoolander. I haven't seen it in so long, I don't know. If you're just saying that, I just don't know what it means. Can't turn left. Is Zoolander? Oh, Here we go. hell yeah! No, I haven't. I haven't seen it in a while, so I don't know if I'll be able to pick up many references. But I'm excited. I think it'll be fun. So that's happening at um, 9 p.m. Central Time, which is roughly two hours from the current time. Also, Monday stream is going to start a bit late. Um, I don't know exactly how late. I'll have to announce it in the morning, but I would assume probably like at least an hour late, probably-ish. I don't think it'll be too late, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna for now say an hour late, and then if it looks like I'm gonna be later, I'll let you guys know. having such a good time. Luigi is so happy. I like playing this game as Luigi. I feel like I should be like trying out more other characters. Great job. Damn, this is this thing is it's really it's like wow you're doing so good but it's like I'm literally invincible. All I have to do is not fall. There we go. Stonks. What fucking what rating was that? Was that a three star level? 
I don't really do it all the time so far. You just get, no, the characters uh, are basically, I think they're all the exact same, which is weird because in Super Mario 3D World and Land, like, there is like a little bit of a difference between them. You're still live AF. Um, I am. That's me. You're able to follow their complex movements? Even I cannot move with their waves so well. Is the master at risk of proving a mere student? Three star difficulty? That was like a fucking half star difficulty. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, wait, that's that's true. The Yoshis and the Nabbit are um are like an easy mode, so they can't die, but they can't use abilities. So, you know, it's a, they do give it a bit of a trade-off. It's like, okay, you can play the game without dying, but you're not gonna get the cute the cute outfits and stuff. You wanna experience that, you gotta play it for reals. So at least there's that. So I think that was the thing about like Funky Kong being added to um, Tropical Freeze is like there wasn't really a drawback to not using him, which is fine. That just means that you're, you know, if you're actually wanting to be hard, you're just gonna, it's not like you're fucking competing for anything. Um, but yeah, I don't know, I kind of like that. I think I think it, it 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 incentivizes children to you know learn to play the game a bit better. Because it's like oh well if you want you know if you want to play with Peach and have the fucking shit you gotta actually you know be okay with dying but there's like other ways right you can do the online mode but then you gotta have internet. This incredibly accurate playback. Yeah, we we just guessed what the My time was. My mom says I'm not old enough to use Donkey Kong and makes me use Funky Kong. No man should ever have to live through that, right? <laughs> Kappa. No man should ever have to do that. <laughs> not being able to accessorize in video game might as well die. Yeah, for real. What's the point? I'm gonna think of that kid for years. My mom took me to see the Barbie movie instead of Blue Beetle. No man should ever have to go through that. No, or do, do, well, I can't remember what the fuck it was at exactly, but it was like you were definitely ten. If your mom is making the fucking movie choices for you, buddy, and you're you're <laughs> sharing it in a Twitch chat, I got unfortunate news for you. You're probably not a man yet, bud. Whoa. It's so magical. Oh my gosh. Wait. How to get the how to get Hmm. Wait. I right, turn around. Like you're not this is peak Luigi form. Go label every stream with ta tax talk and keep kids out. I mean, most of the time playing retro games works enough. Um, and yeah, kids. I don't know. No kids are showing up for Super Mario Wonder for some reason. So yeah, we have a we have a pretty low, I think, kid. Oh, what the fuck? A low kid level uh thing. It's just with uh Mario Kart historically, sometimes kids would show up and be like, Are you letting other kids join the race? My mom says I can play for one hour. And then they start getting angry about shit. That's the worst part. That's pretty much it. Is they start getting being like that person cheated. They did the fucking whatever. And like I'm like I'm babysitting them, and I'm like I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck what they did. <laughs> Off you go. 
somebody blue shelled me and I was actually in second something. I don't know. Where it's like, what do you want me to do? Redesign the game? Wait, no. This sucks. Can we play Roblox? <laughs> Wait, I think it actually showed me a recommended badge. Guess I don't give a fuck. Maybe come back. Okay, no mushroom for me, I guess. No! Actually, one of the people who's harassed me the most on Twitch was the person that we kicked out for being 12. Um, and then, like, seven years later, they'll still try shit. It's like, okay, I know you're not 12 anymore, but what the fuck is wrong with you? Is it like a pay to win Minecraft? It's like, um, oh, shit, it's kind of like, I guess the only thing I can compare it to is kind of like, it's almost like a Club Penguin type situation, but, um, they make, like, people can make mini games in it that, like, people play across the world. So it's not just, like, made by the developer, it's, like, open source almost, like, people can make, like, a Squid Game fucking style mini game and shit like that, and then you can buy outfits and whatever. Um, oh, okay, wait, so I have to go to land over here. Oh, right. I'm gonna fucking die again. I mean, Minecraft has a two, probably just a clone. Um, it's, it's a bit different because it's like an online, uh, like, um, I don't know how to describe it. Minecraft is like a game that you would like download to, like you have it on your computer and then you can like play, like Roblox you don't play solo and there's no building. I I'm sure there might be like a Minecraft game mode, but like there's a lot of little games that you can play is my understanding. And that's like the main appeal is all these little games that the kids can play together. Um, and then they can talk to each other like it's like in Club Penguin, like with the little chats and whatever. Yeah, I still don't fucking know how to get that coin. Hmm. Wait, maybe it's... Hmm. I don't know, maybe, maybe something will happen. Nope, I doubt it now. Yeah, it's not like it's not like Minecraft servers. They're like, like if you go on the Roblox website, I think it just like advertises a bunch of like the games. I I've seen like a little bit of content around it. Um, so I I'm not fully sure. Oh shit. But that's my understanding based off what I've looked at, which is why kids are always like, oh, let's all play Roblox because you can play it. I think with like unlimited people or something.